so much. Well, some business owners in South Orange County are growing frustrated being out of work. They say enough is enough and reopen this weekend. NBC 4's Rick Montanez is in San Clemente, where a restaurant there was at capacity shortly after opening. The owner of Nomad's restaurant tells me he reached out to city and county officials to let them know he was going to reopen, and he tells me no one stopped him. A full house at Nomad's Cantina not long after the doors opened this morning. The restaurant's owner, desperate to make a living again. I'm emotional. It's a bigger fight than for my restaurant. It's for my people. Fighting back tears, Nomad Cantina's owner, Jeff Gorey, says he has 25 employees who rely on his payroll. His restaurant had been serving takeout only since mid March, but that was only bringing in about 10% of usual business. How long do we hide from it, regardless? I mean, we can't stop working, we can't stop living. A sunny Sunday on the Nomad's deck for customers who say they're tired of being stuck at home. I miss the interaction and seeing the smiles and being out. It feels extraordinary to be in a restaurant because it's been six weeks. Inside the restaurant, Gory says he's telling people to practice social distancing. He says he believes he and his staff are young and healthy enough to survive COVID-19 if they contract the virus. I'm just trying to make a living, just trying to keep my store afloat. Around the corner at Ritual Boutique, owner Stacy Cameron says she's following Gory's plan, opening her shop despite state and county health orders. I don't know if I'm going to survive. I mean, having some generous people over a couple of days isn't necessarily going to make me. Um, this has gone on too long. Customers are starting to trickle back into the boutique, but with stay-at-home orders still in place, business is unlikely to return to normal just yet. Both entrepreneurs opened up shop eight years ago. They tell me they believe coronavirus is a real threat, but so is shutting down for too long. Six weeks is plenty of time. That's kind of what I believe. A sunny day like this, I don't feel like anybody's at risk. Reporting in San Clemente, Rick Montanez, NBC4 News.